Okay, I have a speech on my iPhone, but let me just pull it up. Because, you know, everybody's uh, got to have the iPhone. That's one of the things today, subhanAllah. Technology. How many of the people today all had their stuff saved on their iPhones or their mobile devices? So say subhanAllah. But now I want to bring your attention to something. Who likes the decoration? Say takbir. <laughs> who, likes the, who likes the decoration? Say takbir. <laughs> and it, it's something that is always said in every event, but you have to acknowledge the volunteers and the sisters who sat down, thought of the decoration, did everything, the games in the back, all of that took weeks. And subhanAllah, for the last three days, they've been here almost past midnight. And yeah, may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala reward them. Say Ameen. Amen. Okay. The what? Okay. No. Okay. One of the things that, subhanAllah, I'm sure everybody knows their context of what's going on in the Islamic world. We all know the revolutions, we see what's going on, we see, subhanAllah, what happened in Masr, which was something special. And one thing that uh, I'm going to call my father out on this, he says, I told him, he told me that the day that Egypt falls, or that Mubarak falls and Egypt is liberated, is the happiest day of my life. So I asked him, happier than the day that I was born, that my brothers are born? And he told me, yes. <laughs> hey, that's up to him. <laughs> it really was a special day. And subhanAllah, you know, they say that, uh, an Egyptian joke, some guy says, you know, <laughs> he's saying that my father wants me to be an engineer. My mother wants me to be a doctor. My father, my uncle wants me to be a teacher. But you know what I want to be? I'm going to be the guy that stood behind Omar today, madam, he announced that Mubarak has left. Take me in! Take me in! Alright, is anyone working up an appetite? Yeah. Round of applause if you're working up an appetite. Alright. Um, I'm sorry, we're not going to eat now though. Um, but let me just tell you guys, you're going to have a choice today. You know, we're talking about all the dictators in the world who, you know, the, the only choice they made is... What's going on? Who gave them hallucinating pills? Hey, democracy! Democracy, no! Hey, democracy! 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 Alright, alright. After many years of oppression and even more of protesting, we finally got these tyrants out. Take me! Take me! I wasn't talking about Mubarak. I was talking about Qadanani and Qabani. Alhamdulillah, we got them out, and by popular demand, everybody wanted Karim al Gindi and Muhammad Gadallah. Take me! Take me! Now we're gonna have a word with our new leaders, inshallah. Ripton! So I'm talking about. <laughs> Alright, alhamdulillah, after 0.52 years of oppression. 0.52! Haha, anti IT bad joke. At least you're better than Q. <laughs> yeah, so, you know what, guys? It's, it's really great that finally we have a voice, a little bit of freedom. Yeah, we didn't have that before. They, they were tyrants. Like, they said we were funded by foreign MSAs. I don't know, we were on drugs and hallucinogens. Where Only one of those is true. <laughs> Such lies. You know, has, how, many, how many people went to the Egypt, uh, the protest for Egypt and Libya and just rather... Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Yeah, I went, man. It was awesome. But I think we're too used to the Palestinian protests because most of the chants are geared towards that and then they just recycle them. Like, I don't know they come up with this. From the river to the sea, Egypt, Egypt will be free. <laughs> well, I understand how that works for Palestine. You have a river and a sea, Palestine. Free. That, that chant doesn't really lend itself well to the Egyptian geography Not at all. I think we'd be giving up like half the country. But yeah, honestly, my house would be like split in half. It does not work. I don't <laughs> Who's speaking on our behalf? These people need to stop. I never let anyone negotiate. I don't know what's happening. It's so bad. But you and know the occupation now, I agree with that. And, but. and, and the, what about those hijackers? 
oh man, people who are not even Muslim, just like, they do something that you agree with, like, hey, ho, oh, Mubarak has to go, and you're like, yeah. Yeah, I'm doing, hey, hey, yeah, woo. And then, no work. Workers of the world unite! Where? And I don't like, yeah, workers of the world. Whoa! Salam, <laughs> I'm out. I'm not, I don't even work. I'm unemployed right now. It's homeless. <laughs> I don't need this right now. I need Egypt to be free. They're just crazy people, alhamdulillah. The another thing that really bothered me though, was I come to a protest, right? I'm rolling in deep from the bus, from the masjid, right? Doing my Muslim walk. I see this guy walking out of Starbucks, doing a non-Muslim walk, right? Walking, having his cup of Starbucks. I come up to him like, hey, good man, how you doing? What is, what is that you got over there? What is that? Is that Starbucks? I know no, it's Starbucks. No, it's Dunkin' Donuts. I put it in a Starbucks. <laughs> And, and I'm like, where does his loyalties lie? Like, why do you have to call me out on that? Why do you have to call me out? It's not cool. I don't, I don't know. Let's, let's move on to a different topic. What are we going to do now that we've kicked out those tyrants? Oh, all right. Give me a sec. I got to get ready for this. Can you, what are you doing? <laughs> I had enough of you. Anyway, let's go. <laughs> Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. What are you doing, man? Listen, just give me a minute. <laughs> Alhamdulillah, we are going. Alhamdulillah, after you know the dictators left or whatever, now we have a chance as a Muslim ummah to lay down some laws. Wait, that have you been talking about? No, it? just, just wait. All right, <laughs> this gets crazy. So, our first law, inshallah, is everyone is gonna wear niqab. Whoa, whoa, yes, everyone, right? <laughs> Men and women, everyone. <laughs> In front of me right now, you don't even have a beat. Listen, I have a problem. I have great ideas. We're gonna have an MSA frat house. A frat house. We're gonna party all night. We're gonna have keg parties, co ed. It's gonna be crazy. Oh, okay. Alright, look, I'm okay with all No, look, we're not even doing that. We can have LF Amin fraternity, but we're gonna have Qiyam all night, Quran recitation all day. You know what I'm talking about? We're gonna have Zem Zem keg parties, but it's brothers and sisters segregated 10 miles apart. Nikah for everyone, no looking at each other, even guy you can't. Why are you wearing a green? Why are you wearing a green? Hey, no, why are you? Come here, come here, give me this. What is that? Come here. Alright, all right, if you want to have your body burned, that's fine. I don't, it's okay with me. Hey, go ahead. And you know, anyone who follows you too, they can go with you. That's fine. I'm going to, I'm going to, yeah, what are you going to do? What are you going to do? I'm going to on my side of the MSA. Oh, yeah, go ahead. We're having our own halal. Yeah, what are you going to, halal wood? That's harami wood, alright? No, yeah. We're staying here, we're having halal wood. You can have your harami wood. We're having our halal wood. Yeah, don't even look at me. Stop looking. Okay, why do you look don't look at me. Just go. Alright, whatever, I'm done. That's it. Why why are you still why are you still looking? <laughs> uh, <laughs> I, I was a little too strict. I, I, you were a little too strict. I, I went overboard, I'm sorry. And you were a bit too lenient though. No, he wasn't. Admit it. <laughs> a little bit. Alright. He was a bit too lenient. Guys, the whole point of this, this performance is we're trying to show there's a huge problem in our homeland in, 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 on campus with the Muslims. Some, some Muslims are making religion too strict. You know what I mean? Like what I was doing. And some were like this guy. Um, <laughs> all right? I think it's pretty clear I to describe that. But, you know, you can be strict on yourself. Don't make it very hard on others. This is not the, way, this is not the Prophet's way. Alayhi salatu wa salam. Alayhi salatu wa salam. And that's the whole point of our performance. Assalamu alaikum. Wait, 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 wait. One more thing because I feel like we're going to kick. Oh, we're going to get kicked off. I'm oh, sorry. We're going to get kicked off. I just want to remember how the last word. Kabani and Qatarani are actually very oh, yeah. amazing leaders <laughs> that are democratically elected every time with 99.9% of the vote. <laughs> we love them. We want our position still. We love you guys. <laughs> Get back over here. Protest in New York uh, next week against them. Just, we'll see you guys then, inshallah. <laughs>